Hello, welcome back. Last time I got a little deeper into depths. No, no, that's depths. I'm in meta. A little deeper into meta. Uh, opened up a whole new map here, which was pretty neat. Uh, let's take a peek at it. There are no puzzles I can do there now if I don't want to do something that looks like a conclusion, right? I mean, do I necessarily not want to do something that looks like a conclusion? I don't know, what does it look like? So meta is here. The end. It's very tempting to click on this. Clearly I need more orbs. One more orbs. There's another something here. This is... This has the look of a map. Right? Or no, it just has the look of an unsolved level, right? Because, like, if I look at this... I mean, the border around that's a little duller than the border around these. Yeah, I think, like, the vibrancy of the color tells me that this is another map. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, yeah, and that's, that's definitely a place I haven't solved. Um, I don't know what's going on. I don't know what I want to do right now. Kind of tempted to try and win meta with this. What do I think that would take? I think that would take putting two cursors in here and turning them both into ghosts or babas. Probably ghosts because I don't really have good access to a baba keyword, but I do have... I haven't used this for anything. Uh, right, two cursors come in here. They both turn into ghosts. Uh, I don't need a cursor anymore. I just need one ghost here and one down here to push that up. Other one pushes it over. They can merge at that point, push it up, and level is win. Let's see if that doesn't take too terribly much effort. Sure. So I have the one cursor here. How will I get two cursors? Flag is cursor? With one remaining flag, maybe? Okay. That's pretty plausible. So I have to use this flag to open this d door, certain... Um, oh, Baba, ba ba Baba, Baba. There. Um, have to use that to open that to get the text through. That much is definitely true. Careful with that flag. I run out of flags if I do this. Also, my cursor's kind of trapped there at the moment, isn't it? Is it trapped? Yes, I can't get it out. Okay, so I would need to start... If I'm doing this, I need to start this process with... The cursor in a better spot. Here, you're nice and isolated there. I probably won't pick you up by accident. I don't have a fully formed plan to do this, though. I believe I do have all of the necessary transformations to do it, though. Yeah, so it should not be a problem to get this done now. It, m I might need to change... That looks super weird where Baba is. I think the, the dotted line is going over one of his eyes. <laughs> um, yeah, that's what it is. Uh, it's very possible I need to change one of these dudes into something else. Not sure which or what, though. Because I think I need to come out of this process with... A flag left after opening these three doors. Which obviously isn't going to happen when I have only three flags. Unless... I can turn something else into a flag? First... You know, before I do that, let's do something simpler. So an intermediate step on the way to that. Let's first just get one ghost in here and make sure I understand that part of the process before I worry about getting two. So start with just the one. So 
So having opened that, my cursor's sitting there. I can pick it up with you anytime. I mean, this is where I want it, so let's put it there now. There's only words you can really disrupt. I mean, you've already disrupted some words, so you know, be careful with that, please. Um, yeah, you've already disrupted a word. I don't want you to stay careful. Okay, so I picked up the cursor. Uh, that door is not yet open. I dropped the cursor and picked up the cursor. Okay. Uh, let's not merge at the moment. There we go. Okay, so cursor is... Oh, don't merge. Cursor is pretty safe right there as it is. Okay. Oh, don't really like controlling four things at once. I can do it, but it's uncomfortable. Okay, so it is quite trivial to do what I'm trying to do. Let's just ignore whatever chaos is going on over here. Um, just ditch one of these dudes. Sure, that's fine. And cursor is ghost. There we go. I have a ghost. It is me. It can push the level around. Oh, and if I can already cursor is ghost, right, the problem was I wanted to do flag is cursor to get it across here. And to do flag is cursor, I need this door open, thereby losing my flag, which is a problem. I note, however, that I could make ghost is open. Can I make Baba is ghost? No. But yes, I can make ghost is open. This is arranged to allow that. All it feels like that does for me... Oh wait, no, that does do some things for me. Okay, so here's what I can... Um, what I was thinking was that I could leave this as a flag, then make... Well, I'm not going to make flag as ghost. See, I already have to have a flag. I have to have a Baba in here to do all this, don't I? No, how did I get in here in the first place? I did this one somehow. I'm no longer sure how I did it. Oh boy. Meta puzzle. Um... I definitely got in here without having already been in here. I may have to repeat that process, but let's think about this. So for flag, to get together with cursor, Which is not actually what I want for flag to get together with ghost. I do need three doors open. Starting to think I should go look back at what I did to get in here. Let me do that and see if I can gain any information from it and figure out whether it needs to be part of this solution. All right, so what I did for that was to turn cursor into a flag so that I could get an extra flag here. Feels like that doesn't help me though because I need something that is cursor or flag. I need two things that are those things. Like I'm just spending a different resource that I also need for the same purpose. Now there's already a, f well, If I can make another... Okay, so... So I have cursor, I have three flags, I have three doors, I have four babas. It does feel an awful lot to me like I really do want this to be a flag for this purpose, right? Because if this were a flag... If this were a flag, then 
I would have enough resources because I don't need this many babas. I need a baba to turn into a flag cursor type thing. So yes, you should turn back into a flag. Let's do that now. I don't know if that puts me on the right track, but it feels right to me at the moment, so I'm going to try it. So Tangle, you turn back into Flag. This is uh, the easier way to do this. Turning that to Baba was harder. Uh, lava is Float. And Level is Melt and Flag. Because the Baba is a little hard to get, harder to get to. It's not that much harder, but I do hope I don't have to redo this. I feel like this is correct because I can break in here with the technique I used before. Yeah, cursor, where you're not going to do too much mischief. Just stay right there while I operate on these things. Okay, so those are the ones of those I need to open. Now this cursor is going to have to come to me somehow, which it can. Uh, two babas can sink in the water. That'll reduce chaos and make everything easier. Okay, great. So I'm down to one baba and a cursor. That particular cursor needs to turn into a flag. Okay, so this is familiar, this works fine, it's not too hard to do. Uh, I should probably move that cursor before I turn it to a flag. Can I? Or have I already lost my opportunity? Might have already lost my opportunity, that's inconvenient. Uh, let's see, can I... no. No. Nope. Nope. Can't arrange for this to happen the way I want it to, so no cursor pickup is currently possible. How annoying. Uh, so this is fine though. This puzzle state will remain as it is. I'm just going to return to map and then open meta again and restart this process. Okay, so cursor, you sit there. That's fine. My flags are still in place, doing what they need to. Two babas sink in the water. It's you and you. The survivor. I will need to do some stuff with that, so just get ready. Cursor can't do any mischief on its own. Alright, so easy places to do cursor pick up here. Uh, easiest place is still there. Cursor is flag. Uh, then flag needs to become stuff again. Alright, again, this is all familiar. Flag is push, yes, but it needs to be push up here. So it can be and open. So that door is open. Um, so I've done everything that I did to access 11, but now I also have these two flags. Uh, flag needs to stop being push for a moment. And it's also going to have some other stuff to do with it. Does it need to stop being push? I mean, sure, that's more convenient if it does. So now I want flag is ghost. Perfect. Okay. I'm basically done here, right? I think I'm about to win this map. Don't be too close to each other. I don't want you to accidentally merge. Um, yeah, I will have to be real careful about merging. That might be my final obstacle here, which might be a significant one now that I look at it. Should be manageable. Yeah, okay, it's going to be weird. Need to make Ghost as Cursor with them in the right place. Ghost Cursor is, will not do. Careful about merging. 
Okay, what is the direction of the final push that I'm gonna make here? You know what I could also do? Let me make my life a little easier. Ghost is flag. Therefore, oh, see, they're already merging and stuff. If I make ghost as flag, this will take slightly longer to execute, but it'll just be less fiddly. Because if I go back and do this again, I can just push them into place and not have to worry about them moving around at the same time as I'm moving around. So the places I want are here, and probably here would be fine. Okay. So now I need flag is go uh, cursor. Uh, don't put it there. That's a terrible place. There we go. Oh, <laughs> so that cursor totally has a level. Oh, by the way, I'm... I do think that I do want to turn this cursor into a level, uh, and that will that that will probably do something. Oh dear, now I need to make cursor is ghost without merging these. Hold up. Oh boy, let's uh, before I do that, let me have this planned out. Let's see if <laughs> let me have it planned out. He says, then does no planning and does only improvising. That's me. I think this will be good. There. Great. Got two ghosts. Can split them apart. Position you in there. Position you in there. And I'm done. Great. Level is win. Cool. Okay. And that completes depths. Nice. Uh, right, so if I return to map, yeah, depth is all shiny, cool. Uh, if I want to be in meta, is there a nice shortcut there is? Oh, hi, what are you? Whoa, hey, excuse me, who are you? Oh, one of those is probably the end, right? That's meta... And, oh, center, right, that's what it's called. Okay, so we got a shortcut to center. Uh, meta is one, but not complete. It's not complete because I got these two and probably the level that cursor turns into because I think it probably turns into, a, yeah, but depth is shiny now. Cool, okay, well, hey, that's at least one thing accomplished. Um, sure, since it's on my mind, Let's spend a moment trying to turn cursor into level. To do that, I need a level keyword. Who can make one? Is it you or you? It's one of you. I want to say it's avalanche, but which one is avalanche? This is avalanche. It's not avalanche. So somebody has to be able to make level as text. Yeah, no, it's the other one. It's uh, booby trap. Yeah, right. I spent so much time on this. Am I sure I want to do this? Hold on. I had a procedure for this. I enumerated them all. Didn't write them down, though. Shoulda. <laughs> Dang it. Well, I have a video instructing me on how to do this somewhere. I just have to dig it up. Let me make sure I want to do this before I go and do that work. After that, I'm going to make notes of like what the exact procedure was for that because I don't remember when I come back like a week later and need to remember it. Other things I could do. Work on these. Do I think that it is just cursor level and these two left in this map? Glancing at it, yes. It looks to me as though that's all the room there would be for more levels. Yeah, that seems right. Okay. Um, okay, so... <sighs> okay, so if booby trap is going to turn... booby trap level is going to turn into text. 
Let's go through this before doing that labor, just to make sure it, that this makes sense. Obviously, it looks like I have a flag problem if I do that. Because I lose a flag, which is required to get to the cursor keyword, but there's a flag in there. So before I do that, I almost certainly want to turn this back to a baba. Do I though? So the procedure I just did, got in here, had two flags left, turned them into ghosts because I needed two ghosts. That got me down to one baba and used all the flags, so I couldn't do it without this being a flag. If I want ghost, do I want ghost? Why would I need ghost for this? I could very easily make cursor is ghost and have it move itself around. Would it be easier to make ghost is level than cursor is level? No. They're the same difficulty. Well, Kind of. Arguably cursor is level is easier because ghost is one level farther down, but if this is a baba and I don't care about this flag, then yeah, it's the same. Okay. So my level keyword would be here. I cannot have another flag out here really. But now hold on, but the benefit of saying flag is ghost... It's also suspicious that ghost can be open. Benefit of having flag is, oh yeah. So no, maybe I would be better off. I mean, but to say flag is ghost, then I need to already be in here. The only other door to open if I wanted to make ghost open, it's real suspicious to me that these line up, uh, is this one. And I don't need this open for that reason. Uh, level is level, yes. Okay, so what are the problems here? First problem is just getting the words together in the first place. Having this flag go away, taking away a door opener resource, and still being able to get... these words to a word that's in this area. That word would be level. I can't import this flag from here to here and use it to open this door and then just work with level there. I would need to spend this flag on that door. Which would benefit me not at all in this situation, right? Because until I need stuff over here, everything that's involved with this is contained within this area. Okay, so... Um, So, okay, that's the first problem, sure. Once I turn cursor into level, like, all that's required for that is actually just for this door to be open. Yeah, but how are you gonna do that when you don't have a level keyword there? Even if I got these flags out, they're not floating so they couldn't get across the water. That water actually would also be a problem here. Hmm. Uh, right, so once I turn cursor into level, I then need to have a resource that can turn back into cursor so that I can select that level afterwards. Um, am I even sure this does anything? It seems just so much like it would. Like, as soon as that idea occurred to me, it's just like, oh, of course that has to be a thing, right? 
this layering is super weird. These are on the bottom, then one layer up is the orange, then another layer up is the pink. And it looks real weird how they overlap here. <laughs> This is what happens when I'm deep in thought. I see these little rotating things moving around and layering funny, and I get distracted. <laughs> uh, but how else would you do it? This is the only way that makes sense, kind of. So, um... It's also just hard to visualize this, but I kind of have to visualize it. I could, I could do a bunch of labor and turn this into a level keyword and then see, like, where I could go from there. But if I have to turn this into Baba first, or I have to not turn it into Baba first and figure out something else to do with it, then I might have to undo that and that would be even more work. So I'm trying to think through it up front to decide what to do before I do anything. Okay, so um, let's try working backward. So the end state is... After having made cursor is level, I have also made something is cursor, probably either flag or ghost, which would mean I would have a flag or a ghost left over, turned that back into a cursor, picked up that cursor and brought it to wherever the old cursor was, and then entered that as a level. Okay. So that's what the end state is going to look like. That will require cursor is... to be together with the level keyword. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I can't like hijack any of these other keywords. I can do stuff with flag, but that would imply that flag can travel to where those words are or vice versa. These keywords do not help me in this process. There is a level keyword here, which also I think doesn't help me, because I can't get any other text to it. What else could you have been? Is there another resource I could turn you into that could help me here? No. Uh, if I could make you a ghost, then I could make ghost as cursor and have a cursor back. Hold on. Okay, see now this is exactly why I went through this process. So. Let's see what else I can turn that into and see if that might be relevant to what I'm doing here. Because I don't remember what that level is and what it can turn into. This is breaking and entering. Level can turn into text. Or rock. Rock will not help me. I don't have ghost, I don't have baba, I don't have flag. So this can only turn into text. Okay, well, question answered. Okay, so, um, and the cursor's imprisoned now, so I have to do this to get it back. So, if that's a dead end, this is so hard to visualize. Um, So let's first solve this conflict. This, in level keyword form, needs to get together with these. Obstacles that are in the way of that are this door and this water. Those are significant obstacles. I can definitely deal with the water by turning you into Baba. Having that Baba push this out here. and sacrifice itself in the water, as well as having this one also make that sacrifice. Then I just have the door to deal with. But the door is a pretty serious problem. Now I could also sink like some text and no I can't, text is float, never mind. I could sink a flag in the water, but that just makes my problems worse it seems. If I could get both of these flags out somehow, I wouldn't have enough babas to do what I wanted. I have this flag, but I just can't use it because it would consume itself to get to the place where it would become useful. Now... 
Um, so the thing about making Ghost as open, if that were ever useful, problem I see with it is that it's a one-time thing, almost. Eh, it's a one-time thing unless I do a whole bunch of juggling with having a dude still in here and able to push that back out, then another dude out here who can recover it, and that's just, ugh, that's a pretty iffy juggling act. Like, if I have to do any vertical movement or too much westward movement, then that would become very fragile. Uh, but having access to the ghost keyword... Okay, so I think... Most signs that I'm seeing are leading to that I want this to be Baba instead of Flag. Is that easy to do? Relatively. Um... Right, I had to turn this into Flag to win that map. Okay, that's all fine. I just need to sink the flag in the water. Yeah, okay, this is not that hard. There's just one more step than, uh, two more steps, maybe, uh, than the other way of doing it. Lava is float. Level is melt, water is sink. Baba comes here. Level's gonna be Baba. Yeah, okay. One more step, but I don't have to push text quite as far. Okay, so you're Baba now. You have a cursor on you, so let's first reset that. So I can see the... I mean, you know what? Okay, so if this is the goal I'm going for, then let's go ahead and just change um, uh, change this into text. All right, so let me go dig that video up and remind me of how I was supposed to do this. All right, so I reminded myself the trick was to overlap the, the belt and the flag, to turn them both into flags, have them face the same way, have flag be shift so it can push that over. Not too complicated. But yeah, I gotta make some notes of, like, what's the easiest way to do each of these, because I'd like to be able to experiment with it, experiment without it being such a big deal to, like, oh man, I gotta change this to level back again. Oh man, it needs to be a flag again. <laughs> okay, so I have that as text. Got this flag here. Um, Babas, please arrange yourselves. There we go. So that door is open, which means I have ghost. There was a reason I wanted to turn cursor into ghost, and I don't know what it was at the moment, but um, I think there was a reason for that. Maybe. Uh, okay, but with this level text here, I mean, okay, sure, I can open the doors this way at least, I think. So let's go ahead and do that. I'm gonna run out of resources before I can accomplish what I want to accomplish. Um, need you to be different and, oh, I've already pushed that over there. Don't do that. Those are in the same place relative to each other. There we go, I fixed it. Okay. Uh, now why did I do this? I had my reasons. Oh, so many dudes running around. Please find another place to be. Don't merge, though. I might need you separate at some point. I don't know that I do, but I might. So cursor is ghost. Uh, it's a bit premature. I'm not ready for that yet. If cursor wants to be ghost, cursor should be ghost in there. There we go. So cursor is ghost, ghost is in here. So then, um, then what I can do, uh, you two can merge, that's actually okay. So when ghost is open, that gets rid of the door. So cool, great. I can sink these babas and get rid of the water, yes. I know I'm making a mess of this text, don't worry about it. And I do get a level to the this, but oh, oops, I disrupted that. <laughs> Can't go that far. Um, yeah, great, but I don't have a cursor anymore. And I don't have anything to really turn into one. So if I could have spent a baba instead of some other resource. Both things that sank in water were Baba. 
If I could just somehow sacrifice this Baba to like lob that flag over the wall to the other place. That would be all I would need, but I can't do that. Baba can't be open. Open is here. Baba doesn't move that way. Now there is some potential for level is push. Okay, so I could dump this into the water if level were push instead of dumping one of the babas, but I don't care about the babas. I have too many of those. It's overpopulation. This is population control. And the water is gone, but the door is not. I cannot make Ghost's flag from here. I can make Ghost's open, but then I lose all of my resources that are not Baba. And that's just not right. Um, okay, so let's at least do the exercise of um, keeping those separated, getting you in here, having you go all the way up there. And stay on the other side of this while this procedure happens so that you can undo the ghost is open. Ghost would need to be in a different place first. Okay, that's doable. Okay. There we go, okay. Okay, so that wasn't so impossible. But this has gained me nothing. I have no flags left. I'm out of flags. I have an extra Baba. One of you needs to turn into a flag. The only one I know that can do that, though, is the one down here. And if I've done that, I don't have the ghost resource, and I don't know how to move it out of that corner. Do I? Did I use any of the resources down here to make this happen? No. Well, yeah, well, kind of. No. Um. Hmm. I remain reasonably convinced that this is possible. It's just hard. But I think it's possible. Okay, well, I don't want to spend all night on this. I'm a little behind schedule at the moment anyway, so I'm, I'm just kind of out of time. I'm like, I'm currently eating into time that I don't have, so I'd better stop before I go any further with this. Uh, but, okay, well, cool. Um, I did some good stuff. I did win meta. I still have these two that I can just do whenever. And I have center to check out. I should just go to center next time. That sounds like fun. But I should also do these first. I'm kind of, like, since it, it has such an air of finality to it, I feel like I should wait on it a bit. <laughs> but I mean, I already did level finale like half this LP ago, right? So all the other people I watched who, well, didn't watch yet, uh, the other people I follow who started LPs of this game have long since finished by now with fewer episodes than I've put up here. So I'm kind of curious whether they um, just had less trouble with puzzles or didn't go as deep into the game. People were asking early on for recommendations of other LPers when I mentioned this before, but I, I'm not able to watch those now, so unfortunately I can't make any recommendations yet. Because I don't know. I'm, I'm still still working through the game myself. Anyway, yeah, so it looks like that's going to go on for a bit. All right, I'll see you next time to maybe get this done, or maybe work on these, or maybe go to center. I don't know, something. <laughs>